Welcome to Leadership in 60 Seconds. I'm Dr. Adam Bandelli, Managing Director of Bandelli & Associates. Today, we're gonna to cover the role of emotional intelligence on executive presence. The capacity to understand our own feelings and emotions and those of others is a critical component of executive presence. If we cannot perceive, understand, use, and manage our emotions effectively, it can derail our impact as leaders. People that leverage their EQ capabilities are able to understand the perspectives of others, they can adjust their leadership style to the needs of the moment, and they have strong empathy and know how to connect emotionally with people. Leaders with high EQ have the ability to motivate their people, build strong working relationships, and influence the activities of others. EQ is a learned skill that takes practice and diligence to cultivate. If you want to improve your EQ, a great place to start is with an emotional intelligence test. I recommend two assessments that can give you a good baseline. The Baron EQI is a self-report inventory that gives you a deep dive into areas like self-awareness, impulse control, emotional well-being, and emotional management. The Mesquite is an ability-based test that measures your capacity for perceiving, using, understanding, and managing emotions. Both tools are useful to understand where you are today and where you need to focus your efforts to improve. EQ is a critical component for executive presence. When you can understand your emotions and those of others, you'll be able to impact and influence people in a great way. Thanks for watching, friends. And remember, leadership matters. Without it, people fail.